acabar com isso. Oh meu Deus, Sam, não. Golly, this place sure is fancy. I don't think I've ever sat in a chair this expensive before. Oh, I hope you're enjoying yourself. I thought it might be a bit too stuffy. Oh, of course, I'm having a great time. Oh, good, I'm so glad. It's so nice to be able to spend some time together. Absolutely. It's a shame that Sans couldn't come. And where did you say your brother was again? He said that he was working his first shift at a new job tonight. Oh, well, all we can do hey, is... Hey, folks, how you doing? Sans, Sans, what are you doing here? Well, I was working the first shift of my new job. Here. Oh, that's great! Actually, I'm on break now. Do you mind if I sit down with you? Oh, of course! Please, please! I, I brought an extra chair just in case you showed up. Oh, yes, please do. Thanks, bro. So, how are you two doing? Actually, I have to go to the bathroom, so you two talk. I'll be right back. All right, bro. Don't fall in. See you soon, cutie. Sans, I don't understand why you keep doing- You think you're clever? Taking him out tonight without telling me? Without my consent? Do you even know- Sans, who... your brother is not a child. He has grown up, hey, and he- Hey, Don't you ever interrupt me. Listen, Papyrus is the one thing that I hold dear in this world, and I swear if you corrupt him like I know you will if he doesn't go unchecked, I will personally go through every timeline in the multiverse and erase the concept of you. You will never have existed. The only person who will remember you is me, and it'll be a foul, foul memory. Do you understand why I'm saying this? <sighs> yes, I understand. Never ever cross me again. This is strike two. Hello, I'm back. Hey, Papyrus. So, how are you two doing? Oh, we were just talking about the applications of polyurethane. Oh, uh, yeah, yes, yes. Uh, it's very fascinating. No, it's not. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Sans. Hey there, good looking. What brings you to my humble abode on this fine evening? Would you please just get your brother for me? He's not ready yet. You're gonna have to wait. Ugh, okay. While we're waiting for him, I hope you don't mind, I'd like to tell you a story of my great uncle Helvetica. Sans, I have dinner reservations. It all started 300 years ago in the human country known as Ireland. Three hours later. And that's why my family line is no longer allowed in Europe. Okay, Papyrus, he's ready! Oh, good! I've been waiting for so long! I'll be down in a minute! Are you kidding? You was ready the whole time! Hello, Metaton. I'm ready for our play date. <sighs> Papyrus, I told you not to call it that. Well, that's what Sans calls it! Either way, I'm ready to go! Well, there's no point in going now. My reservations expired half an hour ago. Oh, that's a shame. I've got a better idea. The three of us could go to Grillby's. My treat. Oh, that sounds like so much fun! What do you say, Metaton? You want to turn this play date into a three-way? Yeah, sure. That sounds fun. Hey, Metaton! I've been working on my impression of you! Oh, how flattering. May I hear it, please? Okay, here goes. <clears throat> I'm Metaton, and I'm a very cool robot, and I hang out with my cool friend Papyrus, because he's also very cool. So, how was that? I've never felt more insulted in my life. <laughs> oh, that's very good, darling. You bundle of joy. Stay small. Okay, darling? Yeah. Hmm. All right, I think it's done, dear. Do you like it? Do I like it? I love it, Mama. It's perfection. Oh, my God. I need to show your daddy. Oh, my. State your business, little one. I'm the mighty Skullabot, and I'm going to take over the world. Yeah. I believe that's not possible due to your shortness, mister. Yeah. <laughs> also, you're way too cute to do such a thing, hun. And now, the confession. I love thee with undying passion! P Papyrus, I. I. Yeah! Uh. <sighs> yeah! <laughs> that was nice, but there are some errands to be attended. Oh, really? Yes! Very important errands! Now, if you excuse me, Papyrus must go now. Seriously, darling, you're not going away that easy. Yeah? Mm. I love you too, Bubby. Mm. 
Mayday. Uh, Mayday. Are uh, you okay? The grape of fire is melting down for the power of vengeance. Love is extremely infectious. Oh, such All right, oh darlings, it's, it's the, the moment, moment you've all been waiting for. It's time to bring out... The Bone Fucker! Oh, yes. <laughs> I'm the Bone Fucker! <laughs> Such a dramatic and clever twist, I know. Now... Get ready, you filthy sinners! Oh my god! Am I on TV? Hi, Sans! I'm right here, bro. Oh, look, Sans! I've made the, the big time! I have no more words, you sexy skeleton! Just feelings. At least before the senses shut us down. Oh, oh my god! Okay, I don't care if you're dating my brother, but I will not let you make out with him on live TV! You hear me? Papyrus, I had a wonderful time with you! I'd love to share a kiss time tonight. A kiss with the awesome Papyrus? Metaton, I'm flattered, but I can't, sadly. I don't have any lips, so Moses Moth can do his bite. Uh, um, <laughs> why are you looking at me like that? Oh, come here, lover boy. Wait, I'm not Metaton! I found this scarf that I think you'll love, and... M Metaton? Thank you, beautiful... <laughs> papyrus. But I don't want that girly nonsense. I need to man up, Pap. That guy was right. I'm not really a man if I... Wait a minute. Who was right? Not that anything eludes I, the great Papyrus. But I think you should still tell me in case you doubt my... <coughs> it was just some heckler, okay? He said some stuff at my last show and I let it get under my casing. superhero suit helps me feel brave, I thought you could use an outfit to help you feel brave, too! Oh, Papyrus, I... Oh, thank you. Don't mention it! Like I said before, nothing eludes the great Papyrus. Also, let's keep the crime between us, okay? We'll say it was an oil leak. Wait, who's crying? Oh, thank you. <laughs> Metaton, may I talk to you? Oh, but of course. I cannot possibly say no to my number one fan. So, what do you wish to tell me, darling? I, the Great Papyrus, am sorry to inform you that there is a major fault to your look. <gasps> say it isn't so. It is so. For you see, the star is supposed to go on top of the tree, not underneath it. <laughs> Oh no! Has the Great Papyrus upset you? This wasn't supposed to happen! Oh my precious darling! Oh my god! 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 Hey bro, we're about to open presents. You two coming along? My legs are starting to ache. You are the only present I need, darling. In that case, I'm just gonna open Papyrus's present then. Sans? Huh? Did you leave this present here? Nah, it wasn't me. I can't wrap things all that well. I just don't have the... gift! Sans! Well then, we shouldn't let such a festive package go to waste. I, the Great Papyrus, will claim this abandoned parcel. Hello! Oh-ho! Oh, it's just what I wanted for Christmas! <laughs> I am so glad. Did that box come with the receipt? 
So, I made a few minor changes to my initial plans, but, uh, but it's nothing major. It's just some notes. I figured you would want to review them, though. Alphys? Hmm? What about this? Oh, um, that's actually a prototype for the research Ascore has me doing. I just figured I'd also use it as a little practice for when I make your new body. It's, uh, not really for- All I heard was prototype, meaning it needs a test run, right? Well, if you're offering, I guess it can- Wonderful, dear! Please tell me you have some legs for it, though. How can a test run without them? <laughs> okay, so don't tell anyone about any of this, okay? Why not, darling? Because I don't know if this works yet, and I don't want anyone to know that I messed up again. <sighs> Fine, dear. What exactly do I need to do? Oh, um, it's actually quite simple, really. Is that perhaps... Now, um, this may sound a little weird, but, um, I need you to suck on this! Really, dear? You want me to suck on a human soul? Well, uh, now that I think about it, when you say it, it sounds a whole lot dumber. Your soul looks much more appetizing. My soul? Oh, uh, excuse me. I don't know what came over me. I just can see it so clearly somehow. Really? Then try to. Uh, are you sure? Y yeah! This could be a breakthrough. Just be careful. I guess. <laughs> okay, that's enough. How, how do you feel? I'm suddenly kind of tired myself. Mm, not bad at all, now that you mention it. Uh, oh! That's, uh, interesting. Though, your soul... It doesn't seem any different. At all. And your battery charge... It went up? Oh, curious. But... Well, back to the drawing board, I guess. Well, if that's the case, then, do you mind if I maybe keep the body, then? I guess... gave you anything. Oh my god! Metaton! You've run out of batteries! Do not worry! I'll take you to a power outlet! I have an owie on my everywhere. I can't tell you how flattered I am you accepted to go on a date with me, Metaton! Oh, darling, of course. I enjoy your company. Yee! Wowee! But you know, I get the feeling you enjoy a certain brother's company a bit more. <gasps> oh, happy dear! I'm so sorry! Isn't that obvious? Does he know? <laughs> oh no, actually. In fact, I wanted to give you a little advice. Oh, how sweet of you- Oh shoot. I 
didn't mean to knock over the table, but I guess it makes this easier. Metaton. The star of the underground. So handsome and charismatic. Even now, I find you quite breathtaking. You could have any monster you wanted, except my brother. All right. Makeover time. Oh my god. Okay then. Now, let's... Uh... I'm prepared for added handsomosity. <laughs> no skin. No lashes. No eyelids. No lips. No fingernails. No hair. I eyebrows? Oh, wait. Uh, well. Oh my gosh, what is this? I look totally different. A scientific breakthrough of a whole new flavor of beauty. I must tell Sans. This is the best day of my life. Hey Frisk, who's your pal? Never fear, for it is still I, the great Popyrus, now with a whole new image. Looking good, bro. So, uh, do you have any problems with things like this? <laughs> uh... We can't go, Sunny. Oh, uh, no, not really. No weaknesses whatsoever? No trick knee, uh, ruptured huh. discs. <sighs> no, I I'm, I'm afraid I'm uh, fit as fiddle. There are completely silent for almost an hour. Something on your mind? You know how, since you and Undyne have been dating, we've been hanging around those two skeleton brothers a lot? Uh, uh, yeah? I understand Sans. He's horribly self serving, which I can respect, yet still a caring guy. But I don't get Papyrus. Well, he's very excitable and confident. Oh, very confident. To the point of bordering on narcissism. Sounds a bit like you. Of course. It wasn't an insult. That's just... Why is he so confident? For me, it's my overwhelming talent. Adoring fans, sexy custom-made body, but despite his best efforts, he never seems able to prove he's as great as he insists. We've been hanging around him for months, and I've yet to see him follow through on one of his ludicrous endeavors. And even so, I find myself rooting for him. Why do you think that is? Because <sighs> he makes me. That unfaltering cheer, the ambition, the optimism. No matter how many times he fails, he just laughs and never stops calling himself great. He's like the hero of a classic drama. He can sell himself on enthusiasm and charisma alone. He struggles for popularity, but everyone who meets him adores him immediately. He has unorthodox hobbies. Bizarre interests, the most goofball sense of humor, and he's managed to reel me in on all of it. I meet unbelievably interesting people every day, yet he can always hold my attention. He just sells it. He makes me want to hear what he has to say. I don't understand how he does it, 
but he is just so absolutely himself. He makes me laugh so hard. He makes me excited to see him succeed. Uh, 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 Metaton? When he goes home, I wonder when I'll see him again. He's fun to be around. He, he makes me so happy. Oh, Metaton! What? Wipe that look off your face! Metaton Monday. Step aside, beauties. The star is gonna show master class. Wow, we! I thought you've never skated before. I haven't, but I'm naturally good at anything, darling. Whoosh it! Ah! Okay, I'll try. Oh, hurry it up. This is embarrassing. Mm. Uh, come on, just clip into place and... Yeah! <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> Alphys, you should look into this. Molly, no! Metatone's rear panel keeps falling off for no reason. Hmm. Doing it on purpose, huh? I have the right to remain silent. Oh, Papyrus. Don't be nervous. I know you'll do fine. There's nothing to worry about when you're with me. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. This is it. Oh my god. Here, let me give you a hand. Elf has installed all sorts of equipment. Just choose whatever you like best and we'll start. What is all of this? Ah, uh, uh, the dating manual didn't mention anything like this. Ah, uh, let's just go with this one. Huh. Oh? Wait, I actually meant to press this one! Ah! Why do you even have that function? Oh my god! Weren't you taught not to play with fire? I had no idea you were into things of this caliber. You naughty skeleton, you.